Hi, this is Ben Rogerson for Music Radar, and I'm here with Novation's Launchpad, which is an Ableton Live controller. In fact, it says on the box that it's the Ableton Live controller. Um, not sure what Akai are going to think of that, but there you go. And here it is. It's basically, as you can see, flat and sits on the desk, and it's a bank of 8x8 eight eight buttons with further buttons around the side for various functions. It's got a USB port on the side and comes with a nice little right angled USB cable, which is very nice. And underneath there are some rubber feet, so if you're using it in a performance environment, it shouldn't slip about too much. Right then, let's take a look. Okay, as well as the controller itself, you also get Live 8 Launchpad Edition, which is a cut down version of Live 8. That comes in the box, and it's very easy to get the Launchpad set up and running with that. Let's look at the session view first. Okay, in the session view, you can fire off clips. Uh, you can see what you're controlling by the red outline in Live, and each button on the Launchpad corresponds to a clip in Live. If there's a clip loaded, the light is amber, if it's playing, it's green, and if you're recording, the button turns red. So let's just fire off some clips. We've also got these scroll buttons at the top to uh, scroll through the project. You can set up complete scenes by pressing the buttons on the side. Okay, the next mode we're going to look at is a uh, mixer mode. So let's get some audio playing in the session mode and press the mixer button. Um, the top four rows deal with status of volume, pan, send A and send B, and you've got stop buttons and mute buttons here, so let's mute the tracks, and solo buttons as well, and we've got track down buttons as well. We've also got volume page here, so a little green light to let you can see everything's at full volume, but you can bring levels down like that. This is all two ways, so if you just a volume in live, See the launch pad reflects it there, and it's a pan mode as well. So press all those there, everything can be pan hard right, hard left, and all these buttons deal with the levels in between. Okay, that gives you a really quick overview of the launch pad. Um, we literally only got it out of the box a couple of hours ago, so we haven't had a lot of time to play with it, but we do know that it can be used with other software aside from Ableton Live. Um, if you're going to do that, you need to use the version of Innovation's Awesome App software that comes on the DVD. But yeah, it can be done. Um, if you want to read a full review, have a look at issue 145 of Computer Music, which goes on sale on October the 26th. But yeah, that's Innovation's Launchpad.